Hey guys, thank you so much for watching this series, and I hope you're enjoying it. However, there's going to be a small hiatus in it for a bit after this VOD. That's because, as we were going on, the objectives started getting progressively less functional, the mutators started breaking, the two-player aspect was causing a lot of issues, and worst of all, the client was crashing repeatedly. So, unfortunately, there's going to be a bit of a delay, and in the meantime, I'm going to be running Stalkers Only and uploading it here. Dweeby was juggling his finals with making this mod, and it meant that he didn't have the ability to dedicate the time that he needed to to getting the bugs fixed. Now he's done with those, and he's going to be able to put a ton of polish onto this series, and hopefully make it into something absolutely wonderful. So, thank you guys for understanding. I hope it's not too much of an inconvenience, but until then, I hope you enjoy this episode. So much. Between the StarCraft 2 and StarCraft 1 soundtrack, which do I prefer? Terran soundtrack and StarCraft 1 is the best of the StarCraft soundtracks. The rest of StarCraft 2 is better than StarCraft 1. And then the Zerg and Protoss StarCraft 1 are not as good as they are in StarCraft 2. I think, uh, I would say that Zerg in both games is fairly equal. Protoss soundtrack in StarCraft 1 very weak. Terran 1 is the best of all the StarCraft soundtracks. All right. So we are on Cutthroat, the mission where we have to get money for Colonel Orlin, and we're going to see how this goes. Slim pickings. No. Is this fixed? What do we do? Wait, what was the other one? Um, message log? Wait. Uh, I was I was thinking about slim pickings. Did anybody see what the other one was? We move on scene. Oh no! So there's gonna be clo every unit is cloaked. Pirates have been stripping down ships here for years. And then this might actually not be that bad. Now that I think about it, I'm building my blimp. So one thing that was added into this mod is a blimp unit that is a very, very weak detector. And that is for obvious reasons. You need some sort of ability to see in the mission. So, there we go. Pop out, my friend. Let's get some Outback Hunters because they are cheap. And I'm going to get some more Mercenaries. So I just need to be careful with the blimp. It does only have 100 HP and it costs 200 minerals. So it is bad. Like really, really bad. Yeah, there's mercenary vultures that are cloaked. Uh they're not they're not great, but they're pretty cool. I left a little present out here for you and Matthew. If these attack me again, I'm gonna cry. Last time your boys were here. Oh. <laughs> they attacked me again and then ran away. Fine. I'll kill you, Mira. Good That's so stupid. So, for people who don't play much co-op, the slim pickings mutate- Oh, no, my blimp! Oh, there's a hybrid there, too! Crap. Crap, 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 crap. Oh, that's a hybrid dominator, too, not just a generic hybrid. Okay. We gotta pull back so that spider mines take these out. Nope. Uh, this hurts. This really hurts. I'm just gonna keep getting mercenaries because I feel like they're the best possible thing in the early game. Are you mistaken to stay the 24 hour stream? Well, it is not June currently, so yes, you are mistaken. Oh yeah, I can't pick up with the second player. I have to do it with the first one only. Orlin already has $2,000? Holy crap, he's a third of the way done. Uh, I need to kill one of his bases. Let me... Just start dropping some stuff over there, and then I'm going to have to build another blimp so I can have a defensive at home blimp to detect. And start picking up. I'm so far behind. Oh, mutators for those who don't know. So the mineral one is money falls from the sky, but I only get $1 per pickup. Thank you. So that's why I'm not really focusing on mining or anything. Unfortunately, it looks like Colonel Orland does not care. He does not play by the same rules as me and is getting five per pickup as normal. Otherwise, this would be the easiest mission ever if he was only getting one. Uh, 
Okay, that's one of his three bases down. He's going to have two more. Let's heal up. And there's so much money around here. So I'm going to have to be very active picking up all this cash. And anytime that I move away from my blimp, we move unseen really gets me. Oh, here they come. This is why we build a blimp. So they did eviscerate my mineral line, but that's also kind of okay. You know? Oh, <laughs> spider mines are such a unit. <laughs> Super balanced. And then there's some cloaked marines over there. So I want to come down here, take down this base. Uh, get some vulture mercenaries to take out these marines that are attacking me. Build a bunch of spider mines over here. And then I guess some spider mines over here. Let's go for the base. And it's kind of bugged out with player two where mirrors mercenaries attack, so... Uh, uh, yeah, I just don't get those beginning reapers. That's okay, though. I'm not in a bad spot, I think. Assuming that Colonel Orland's base doesn't have, like... Oh, it's gonna be obscene, isn't it? There's no way that I can just take Mira's army and kill Colonel Orland, is there? <laughs> There's gonna be hybrid inside of it. Oh, I don't want to deal with that. So let's swing down here, get the money, and then there's one more Colonel Orland base right up here. Oh, more money. Nice. I don't really care about the barracks, but I don't want to lose it because it does act as a buffer. If the enemy comes to attack me, it's nice to absorb the shots, you know? Keep this minefield going, and then get attacked on the other direction. Oh, it looks like the mines did connect. There's a whole lot of dead bodies over there. <laughs> it's cloak versus cloak. Mineral pickups give me 100 each? Yeah, it's pretty good. It works out really well on this mission, actually. Ooh, another hybrid. So we gotta kite this guy backwards. But Concussive Shell seems to work on him. I guess they're not massive in Wings of Lifty, are they? Because you can pick them up with Phoenix as well. Oh, Mr. Blimp, you need to keep fighting. And we are definitely going to win this. Nice. I'm really glad that I didn't get microtransactions on this one, by the way. Microtransactions, it costs money to use every single action. That would be the worst on this mission. I was thinking about making a curated version of this where you specifically know what mods are coming. So you could do stuff like uh, the money from the sky plus microtransactions for this mission, that sort of thing. Maybe hold it up to like community vote to see what should be done where. That could be a really cool idea. Welcome to all the first timers, by the way. I'm sorry that I'm not saying much to chat. I was kind of in a very hectic mode right there, making sure that I didn't lose. But I hope everyone's doing really good today. What are the hybrid called? There are... The Reaver is the one that is just the Zerg auto attacker. The Destroyer, I think it is, is the small spellcaster one that lifts people into the air and doesn't destroy them. Then the Dominator is the spellcaster that kills everything and is by far and away the scariest. And the Behemoth is just really, really tanky. And it's a Cyclops, for some reason. <laughs> and I've never really understood that. I'm going to get Diamondbacks and... Oh. I have an idea. I have a very good idea. Okay. We just have to live. <laughs> so this mod, in addition to having everything, has all of the units from the game that didn't make it. So we do have the Herc. 
that was in the Heart of the Swarm beta and then removed. Oh, no, it's doing that thing again. For some reason, the default hotkey for the Herc is the same default hotkey as the Medic. They're both E. And I'm playing from the editor, so I don't really want to change things because it's a pain. So I have to constantly continue to be on the map, grabbing all this cash that's flying from the sky. While I'm building up my barracks count. I'm not sure that Grid would help too much, honestly. Grid's one of those things that works really well with muscle memory, but I don't know what slot by default the Herc is in, so I would have to look down and find it anyway. I'm not sure. How many Hercs is it going to take? Do we know? I'm going to get plus one, plus one for my Hercs, and then I'm going to do a plus one, plus one Herc timing, because everyone knows that's the standard way that you play StarCraft. Oh, detection. Um, I guess we just build a missile turret up here, pull these back, let them walk into missile turret range. Try to get these back. Uh, let's get this blimp over here. Okay, this isn't going well. Pull these back. Come on, walk into range, please. There we go. These require a tech lab, okay. And my guys went the wrong way, so then I wasn't able to come and reinforce with my blimp. This blimp is gonna fix things though. Then we're gonna move the siege breakers up here a little bit so that they tank a little bit stronger. I'm never gonna use grid. It It's a personal thing with my hands. My hands don't work too good, so I have to use my own hotkey setup. Oh no, I'm getting 1-1-1. One, one, one. <laughs> I didn't notice this evac. Yeah, whatever. I think that this is going to work fairly decently, honestly. So... Just keep moving over here. Let's get some more spider mines. Yeah, Dweeby did a great job making this. He's been absolutely incredible. I'm really happy with all this. Alright, boys. <laughs> they don't all do it at once, that's not good. That's gonna make doing this way harder. But it's okay, it'll be fine. So, I want a blimp over here to give me high ground vision. Oh no, the wraiths. What are we going to do? Pull back. Get that vision. What a dumb unit. Can you believe this almost made it into multiplayer? Uh, it, if you ever want to see this in action, by the way, the first Archon Mode Showcase, I believe it was, for Legacy of the Void, uh, they played a Archon Mode game on Frost with the new Legacy of the Void units at the time, including the Herc, and it was an adventure. And one Herc <laughs> killed, it killed like 20 supply. It was so stupid. Oh, this thing's vision range is garbage. Are you kidding? Why can't it see? Baby, did you nerf this? Because I built a bunch of hercs. It has to be on the plane to see. Oh. Oh, that doesn't stun or anything. Um... So I'm going to have to make multiple blimps and then charge them all at the same time. There we go. I'm going to get four blimps. And then I'm going to regret my choice to build this unit. 
Your forces are under attack. And then I'm going to build, uh, I don't know, what's good? Marines? And Diamondbacks to make up for the fact that I'm wasting all my time and my money and I'm going to have to redo this. Nope, 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 nope. The elite medic's really tanky. I guess I'm waiting for number five. Diamond back, diamond back. Oh, this is a stupid idea. But I guess... Yeah, I'm so committed. And these aren't good in a real fight. They're just a really garbage unit as part of an army. Get him, get him! Oh no, the Goliath! <laughs> this isn't working. <laughs> this isn't working at all. <laughs> Mmm, that's not good. Well, let's get the minerals and... Um, I don't know. I think I just have to dive it. But I need a bunch of blimps if I'm going to dive it because I know they're going to accidentally kill my blimps. So I probably need like five of them. I'm going to send this guy around the map to... Oh, look! We have five more of these. Perfect. We're fine. So, that's the Herc. I'm never going to use it again. But I honestly thought that it would be a good strategy. Because I'm an idiot. Uh, what do we want here? Let's get some Marauders. They're pretty tanky. Oh, this fight's going to be miserable getting into Orland's base. I know it. There's no way that it would ever go well. Forty Marines in that position would get massacred too. Yeah, I mean... Yeah. You are correct. I just wish you weren't, you know? I'd prefer it if you kept being correct to yourself. <laughs> then I wouldn't have to deal with the fact that my ideas are dumb and I'm losing to a bunch of raids. Okay. We're gonna try again. Can we use Herx on Maw of the Void? No. Maw of the Void is gonna be hard. Like, that mission is already pretty tense money-wise, and then it's going to be a stupid, stupid existence with whatever mutators we get. Alright. Let's go. Yep, there's hybrid up here. And it's really bl bright because of the blimps. There's a siege breaker up here that needs to die. Okay, the ghost is down. Oh, these ravens. They normally don't cast Seeker Missile here. I think. Oh, hybrid behemoth. Target it down. Pull these guys away. Not bad. We had critical mass. Dive it. Alright. We got it. I've only lost like 90% of my forces. Perfect. Take 